Today we're going to review how to upload CMM results to a NetInspect FAI. We're going to do this using NetInspect's Measurement Collection Service. NetInspect's Measurement Collection Service enables companies to extract specifications and results directly from the native CMM output files and post these results either to Form 3 of an FAI or to NetInspect's Quality Management Solution for Process Capability Studies and SPC Analytics. NetInspect supports multiple CMM devices. This includes Hexagon, Zeiss, Meditoyo, Nikon, to name a few, and a full list of devices is available through our Help Desk Knowledge Base. We will post uh, the link to the Knowledge Base list within the comments and description of the video. There are two ways to upload CMM result files. The first option is the option that we're going to use today, which is our drag and drop interface. The second option is to upload the files automatically via an FTP connection. We can work with your site to help establish that connection and then you'll have your software, whether it's say Zeiss Calypso, uh, write the files to that location and then NetInspect will automatically download, process them, and post the results to your account. Right, we're going to start by logging into NetInspect, finding the first article, and navigating to Form 3. Once you're on Form 3, just above your Bill of Characteristics, you will see a Tools drop-down. If you select this drop-down, you can then choose the option to upload CMM results. When you select this option, you'll see your characteristics from Form 3 on the left, and on the right side, you'll see the option to drag and drop your CMM result files. I have my CMM file open in my file explorer, so I can drag, drop the file, select upload, and the measurement collection service will extract the description, specification, measurement, and it will try to identify the characteristic number. If it's unable to identify the characteristic number, perhaps uh, the characteristic number does not match your bubble drawing, if it's in a different sequence than the bubble drawing, we do have other options available. When You can select all the characteristics and then use our auto match, which auto matches based on specification, description, or line number. NetInspect will then match up the results based on your preference, and if any results are unmatched, like in the case of this profile, I can choose to type in the characteristic that I want it to match the result to, and it will place that result against that characteristic. Once I hit Submit, it will notify me that results were added, and I can scroll down and view how the results fall in relationship to the specification. Fortunately, I don't see any reds. So this means all my results were conforming, and I can mouse over, see the date and time they were posted, as well as the percentage of tolerance used. If you have any questions about the solution, feel free to contact us at helpdesk at netinspect.com or sales at netinspect.com. Thank you for the time.